Welcome back everyone. You're watching Crichton Pet Services channel dedicated to dogs and everything about them. I'm Stephen Crichton and you join us on Tuesday the 27th of September in the morning with the little guys in the middle of Edinburgh. Look at the day. Look at that. It's a little bit windy and a little bit fresh but we're enjoying our morning but we've actually had a little bit of a problem this morning so um, this is a difficult one because I'll need to explain this to the owners as well as explain it to you but we have Juno here her border terrier and she's kind of the boss of the pack even though we don't really subscribe to those kind of things but we also have Alfie if you can see there at the back of the pack he's cocking his leg just now Alfie another border terrier and uh, he and Juno are just not really seeing eye to eye at the moment now at the moment this is as close as they probably have been and that is about maybe I don't know maybe 10 or 15 meters apart and um, as we walk as a pack Alfie's really hanging back away from the rest of the pack maybe up to about 50 meters back which isn't good for my kind of heart rate and it's not good for Alfie and I don't want to exclude him from the pack so we need to figure out what's happened I don't know if we'll be able to figure this out today but certainly my eye is on the young dog at the back of the pack today and uh, we're trying to figure out what is causing it so here's Juno being playful with Barney just now as I say there's been no incident uh, inc incident at all there's nothing that's happened but something has spooked him and it's definitely Juno from the way that I've kind of got Alfie to interact with some of the other dogs it's definitely hot so we'll see what happens but stay with us and we'll show you how this unfolds I'll be back at the end to explain how it's all gone but from now on here's the dogs Pop it. Alfie ran off come on in let's see Hi buddy, are you coming? Yeah. Come on in. Ruby! Good girl. Come on, Otis. 
Champ, you're me your pal. You're safe in there. Right guys, so we are wrapped up. All the dogs are safely back in the van. We've had no incidents at all during the course of the walk. But um, Alfie is really giving uh, Juno a wide berth and I don't know the reason behind that at all. I really wish I could explain it. Um, she's done nothing wrong. She's actually interacted really well with a lot of the other dogs and uh, completely ignored him altogether. Not not in the sense that she's going out her way to ignore him, but just because he was, was giving her a wide berth. So he's, he, she's not targeting him or uh, causing him any sort of distress, but he's still um, a bit wary of her. So I imagine at some point, either last week or the week before, she's broken some of the engagement rules with him and uh, there just needs to be a bit of trust there to build that back up. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we can get that trust re-established and built back up between the two of them because up until I noticed this today, they've been very, very close friends. In fact, maybe last week there was a there was a bit after he had been hand stripped. Um, I did a video on that, but in a, with those two things as an exception, they're very, very close dogs, and uh, it's a bit sad to see this happening, and also a bit worrying for my part. So they're all in the van, everyone's safe. I'm gonna get them back home. I'm going to try and get myself a cup of tea. It is cold in Edinburgh today. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you want to know how this story unfolds and, and see more of the dogs, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and we'll see you on our next walk. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.